Guys, listen this audio. Fitness is a journey and all of us could use a companion. Fit and Fab keeps you company and makes you more regular with your workouts. It keeps a close watch on your heart rates too. Whether you like running, swimming, or something else, it always gives you accurate workout stats and suggests cross-training plans based on your fitness routine. If you also want to generate a audio or complete audio script something like this, then you need to use this text to speech AI tool and the name of this text to speech AI tool is morph.io and if you don't know how to use this tool then definitely this tutorial is for you so watch this video till the end and by the end of this video you'll be able to create this kind of world class audios by just writing few lines you don't have to record the audio you don't have to do any kind of mixing mastering or any hassle you just have to write the script basically you just have to import the script and you are done you just need to click on the play button and you'll be able to you can build goals this for yourself kind of audio and fab will ensure you stay on track in that. let's build a fitter you every day right so let's start this tutorial so guys in order to use morph.io obviously you need to go on your browser and go on google and type here morph dot io or you can just simply type morph and it should be m u r f this is the proper spelling right so don't do any mistake here like uh, don't type morph or m a r b m a r f no m u r f right and just hit the enter button simply you will see the first a website which is morph.ai this is not morph.io sorry for that right it is morph.ai right so you can type in morph.ai as well now just click on the first search result and this is the morph ai or morph.ai's website and you can go through the website you can go through the frequently asked questions if you want and you can get an idea like how morph.ai works right i'm not going to give you the website overview or anything else i'm going to just give you like how you can use morph.ai and create astonishing sound which you can use in your content right but before that let's talk about the products if i go to the products option you will see some products which are totally audio based so basically morph.ai is a audio based company so with that technology they have developed multiple audio generation tools like text to speech which is which we are going to use right now then we we do have voice cloning we do have ai dubbing ai translation morph voice installer and morph api you can use morph api as well so these all these are audio based or the voice based uh, technology tools right then you can go to create so i'm not going to explain you all these things right directly let's go to the pricing section and let's talk about pricing a little bit right in the pricing section you will see the pricing plans over here the first one is totally free so we are going to use the free plan here as nobody wants to pay up front if you like the tool then you can go for the creator or the business plan otherwise you can use the free plan itself and there's a simple hack which you can apply in order to use morph ai totally for free right so in the free plan this is going to cost you obviously zero dollar in free plan you can create two projects and you can generate up to 10 minutes of voice or 10 minutes of audio right so this is the main perks you get here and in the creator plan the projects extends to five project and the uh credits you get is 24 hours a year right this is for year if you change it to monthly this is right now as you can see build yearly if you toggle this button to build monthly then you will be able to see that this is going to charge you the creator plan is going to uh, cost you 29 dollars five projects and two hours monthly and then business plan 99 dollars 50 projects and eight hours monthly you can expand it as well it is totally up to you in plus plan plus plan cost you 49 and then plus business plan cost you 199 and then uh, in the plan basically the voice generation credits expands right but just leave these aside we are going to use the free version where we are going to get only 10 minutes of voice generation but as i told you there is a simple hack 
by which you can use Morph AI totally for free and that is for lifetime. And what is that simple hack? You need to create multiple Gmail accounts or multiple email accounts. And what you can do is you can sign up every time whenever you exceeds your 10 minutes of free credit, you can create your new account and you can get 10 minutes for free again, right? And you can do that again and again several times and definitely it is going to be enough for your future projects as well, right? Because let's take an example. If you have six Gmail accounts, definitely you can get one hour of voice generation credit, right? And if you have 12 Gmail accounts, then you can get two hours of voice generation credit, which is equally or equivalent to $29. So you already saved $29 with just 12 Gmail accounts, right? So this is how you can use Morph.io. Although this is not the legitimate or this is not the ethical way to use any tool because these tools spends millions of dollars in their servers, in their technology and definitely we should pay them to use their services use their technology but just in case if you don't have the money or if you are not if, if you are not in that condition that you can uh, be at this 29 dollar or 199 dollar cost in that case you can apply this hack otherwise i would recommend you to go for the uh, creator plan uh, creator light plan which is going to cost you 29 dollars a month right but let's start with the free plan right now. This is the free plan. I'm going to just click on the get started. And on this page, I will land. And from here, you can manually enter your email ID and password. And otherwise you can go with your Gmail account. I mean, Google account, Microsoft account, and Slack. These three options are here. So let me uncheck this box and click on sign up with Google because I do have login into my Google account. So. I'm just going to sign up with Google. I'm going to select my email ID and it will automatically sign up into morph.ai, right? So I don't have to do anything extra. As you can see, I have already logged in into morph.ai. Now from here, this is the morph.ai's panel looks like. This is basically when you log in for the first time, it will automatically create your first project and name it my awesome project, right? So here you can see the blocks, but what I'm gonna do is, I'm going to go back to the dashboard. I'm going to click on this logo. And when you click on the logo, you came to the dashboard. This is the dashboard or the home screen of Merv.ai. And here you'll be able to see your project. So if you want, you can delete it by just doing this. And your project is totally deleted, right? So in the left-hand side menu, you see some uh, multiple options like home. So right now we are in, by default, we land on home where you will be able to see create project by clicking on this. You can create new project, create folder. You can create new folders so that you can segregate multiple projects. But in the free version, we do get only two projects. So I don't think we need to create any folder, right? Then if you have any teammates, you can invite those teammates as well so that you can work on the same project. But in the free plan, we can't invite and use this thing, right? This is for the pro plans. So let's leave this option. We are going to use the core features of Merv.ai and that is voice generation. After that, we do have shared with me. If someone has shared the project with you, you'll be able to see all those projects here. And if you have shared the project with someone else, they will be able to see the shared project in their shared with me, with me folder, right? After this, we do have templates option. So these are the templates option. Basically, these are audio uh scripts which you can use if you want for example this is a shoe promo so if you click on clone this will clone the complete audio of a shoe promo advertisement kind of thing and you can uh, customize that uh, audio or you can customize that script according to your choice and you can use this that project or you can use that voice generation for your content so there are a few templates like shoe promo adventure buddy uh, charging network and few are few uh, different projects are here like this is from mobile app explainers this is from presentations right and this is podcast intros for example if i go to mobile app explainer if i click on this one food or home food delivery or maybe ev charging application like how this application work or maybe I mean, how this template work 
or this template thing work overall. So let's go with this fitness assistant apps. So this is going to be a normal script which we can use and customize basically to you uh, to use in our project. So what I'm going to do is I can click on clone. Right. Wherever you click, this will by default do the clone. So here uh, this is the project name which is fitness app fitness assistant app clone and this is the folder so if you have created multiple folders then you'll be able to uh, you would be able to see those folders but there is only one folder B basically our account and by default the, that account is one folder so the clone will be saved in that folder only right so hit that clone button and your project is getting cloned basically the template is getting cloned and then we can use that cloned item so within few seconds, the cloning is complete and this is the audio sample or the uh, template script is here. If I play on, basically if I uh, click on this play button, I'll be able to listen this line only. So this is basically the complete script line wise line. As you can see, first, second, third, fourth, fifth. So I do have only five lines in this script. If I play on these play buttons, I'll be able to listen these lines one by one otherwise if i click on this play button then i'll be able to listen the complete project for example uh, if i want to listen this script only i mean this line only so i can play click on this play button fitness is a journey and all of us could use a companion fit fab keeps you company and makes you more regular with your workouts so this is how you can use this template basically uh, if i click on this this play button this will uh, generate the audio of this complete script and this will give you the preview as well for example if i click on this play button fitness is a journey and all of us could use a companion fit and fab keeps you company and makes you more regular with your workouts it keeps a close watch on your heart rates too whether you like running swimming or something else it always gives you accurate workout stats and suggests cross-training plans based on your fitness routine. You can build goals for yourself, and Fit and Fab will ensure you stay on track. Let's build a fitter you every day. See how perfect this was. Right, this was like totally original audio, right? And how it has been done, this is basically some content and few customizations like in the audio in the uh, mood section and in different uh, pitching and speed section right so after doing that customization you can create these kind of audio basically you can to create these kind of audios this was totally the template if you want you can use this template by just adding few things basically uh, you can customize this uh, template and you you can use this audio sample for your project as well this was the uh, fitness assistant app presentation right now if you want to use this audio you can use this otherwise you can leave it you can click on the home option and you will land on the on your home and as you can see we have used this as one project so here it is showing one by two so basically we have uh, used one project credit out of two Right, so if you want to create multiple projects, let's say five, four, uh, five, six, seven, eight. So in that case, you need to uh, delete the previous projects in order to create the new one because you can create only two projects in the free version. Right, so keep this thing in mind. Now let's create the second project. I'm going to click on the create project option because this time I'm not going to use any template. And here I'm going to name this project. So I'm going to name this project my awesome project demo one right and the folder will be obviously this one the by default one and just click on create project and this will create the project now this time we do have totally empty project right so uh, here you can see the blocks and below this you can see different kind of audios which you can use otherwise you can just close this Basically, this shows you some kind of suggestion which audios you can use and you can obviously close this and you can change the audio from this option by clicking on this uh, audio option. Otherwise, you can click on this explore AI voices as well. 
same option opens but before that before going or before talking about the odd voices option let's talk about this uh, whole dashboard so here we can see blocks so what we can do is we can create multiple blocks for example i want to create one or i want to uh, write one line here my name is dan and what's your name so this is the line i have created for example i just want to use uh, this block for this line only right i don't want to add more content in this block in that case i can add more blocks like this like this i can add multiple blocks and i can go as much as i want right so i can delete these blocks as well now this is the first block here the voice is natly right if you want you can change obviously uh, the character name is dan so let's change the voice to terrell this is male voice this is female voice you can see the initial after the name natly f which is female terrell m which is male clint m which is male carter miles then phoebe then car charles then amara right so then so on and so forth so leave this thing for now let's talk about the block first so after writing this you can test basically you can uh, check the preview of this audio as well with this character so let's go with the natly first if i click on this generate audio button this will generate the audio and again you need to click here in order to listen the preview my name is dan and what's your name right so this was like something like this if you want you can go to terrell select the terrell let's play it again my name is dan and what's your name this was perfect right so the line was totally perfect with terrell if you want you can change the pitching and even the tone as well the tone uh, terrell stone is basically inspirational tone if you want you can search but uh, the tone available with terrell's uh, voice is totally inspirational so you can get different different voices with different different tones as well right let's talk about audio i mean the characters or the audios now so you can directly click here in order to open this option otherwise you can click here as well explore ai voices here you will be able to see 120 plus voices and 20 plus languages and if you click here you will be able to see different voices from here so you can see english us canada accent so basically these audios have accents as well right then second we have english uk accent then we do have english indian accent right basically us canada accent is different uk accent is different then indian accent is different in a same way australian accent is different scottish friends uh, friends french accent is also different and french language is also different right then we do have french canadian accent the language will be french but the accent will be canadian because there are lots of uh, frenchmen in the canada right then german in a same way we do have multiple language and accent options but the vast or the majority options are available in english us and canada accent right after this you can select the character as well for example you want male female or maybe non binary right so it is totally up to you otherwise after that uh, you can select the age group as well for example you want to filter all the audio options for young age on i mean young only so these are the young adult options then we do have kid options as well there's only one kid oliver right in a male and in female we do have two kids gracie and hana right and in middle aged we do have these female options naomi clara and charlotte june clara and after this we do have male options as well tons of male options are there right but you need to keep in mind that in the free version everything is not free i mean everything is not available all the voices are not available there are few pro voices which you can't use so if you want to hide the pro voices you just need to turn this toggle on and this, now you'll be able to see all the free options which you can use in the free version so if i can uh if i go on all age options and if i turn off this uh male or female option then these are the free voices i can use 
in English, US, Canada accent. These are the free voices I can use in English, UK accent. These are the free voices I can use in English, Indian accent, and then so on and so forth. So let's go with the English, US, Canada accent. Let's go with Miles. Or maybe we can choose someone else. Charlotte or maybe else. For example, I'm going to use Miles. Right, so I can click on this play button in order At to some point in life, Miles we have all voice. wanted to take photos like a professional. Through this right, video, if I select you Miles, you'll be able to see tons of different tones over here. But because we earlier we were we we have chosen Terrell, but Terrell is not the uh, not come under the free plan. That's why we do have only inspirational tone. We can't or we don't have any other tone with Terrell. Right, that's the drawback of the free plan, right? So let's select this, select Miles. Now this time, Miles will uh, repeat this line. And this is basically, these are the tones which you can use. So let's go with the inspirational only. If I, if I want to preview this audio, hit the generate audio button and click on play again. My name is Dan, and what's your name? Right, so the, this is how you can use this. Now, I'm going to create one complete project. So for that, I'm going to use ChatGPT and create one sample script, which I can use here. So I have used ChatGPT to create this demo script. Now I'm going to use this demo script for my demo project. So let me just do one thing. Let me delete this audio. I have shown you all the options over here. So let me just delete this. And now we do have empty space over here. Now, for example, we want to upload the script. So there's multiple options. For example, if you want to create the project here itself. So what you can do is you can copy one line one by one and you can paste it like this. You can uh, paste it here like this. And then you can add block and paste here and then add block pasting here, something like that. Otherwise, you can direct download the script and you can uh, directly import in murph.ai. How you can do that? So for that, you need to go to import script button, right? So after just explore AI voices, you do have the import script option. You just need to upload the script over here. It can be text file, it can be doc file or it can be SRT file. It is totally up to you. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to download this script from my Google Doc into docx format, right? So as you can see, it is downloaded. Now I'm just going to select the file, go to downloads and select this demo script and click open. Within few seconds, the script will be uploaded here, right? Once the script uploads, you will see the, this option. So what you can do is you can import this script as a paragraph basis. So in that case, this will create multiple blocks paragraph wise, right? After this, we do have second option, which is uh, split script by sentence basis. So this, if you select this option, the script will be split it into the sentence basis. And if you are selecting this option, basically why we are splitting these, this script, because so that we can do multiple, I mean, uh, we can do specific changes or we can specifically do any kind of changes in all the blocks, right? For example, if you don't split, you can select this option and this will uh, create a script like that. And in that case, you'll be not able to uh, specifically do any kind of changes in each line, right? So this is totally one block and you'll be able to uh, just control all the thing with only one settings. So for different lines or for different uh, uh, characters, you can't change the voice or you can't change the pitching, you can't change the tone, right? So I would suggest you to go with the split script by sentences, but you can go with script, uh, split script by paragraphs as well. It is totally up to you, right? So this is basically recommended for uh, audiobooks, port, podcast, and other long, long scripts. And this is basically recommended for video scripts, dialogues, and short scripts. So we do have short script. We are going with this one. Just click on import script and the script is imported now. These are the 
previous blocks let me delete these blocks one by one now the script is starting from here and ends here and this is basically a conversation right not a conversation this is basically uh, a person who is explaining about digital marketing right and in between there is a uh, one more different character female character the name is sara right and sara's line is this sara will speak that digital marketing isn't just about posting ads it's about connecting with people on a personal level right so this is the this is sara's line right so all these uh except this this third block all these blocks will be uh powered by a male voice but this the third block will be powered by a female voice because sara is female right so what we can do is we can first obviously we need to click on this character icon so that otherwise you can click on this uh, this this text option and automatically these all options appears if you click here all these option will automatically appear like this right you can click on miles and you can select whatever the character you want right so let's go with miles right so right now uh, if you want to change for example if i click on hide pro voices you can see these if you click on mail these are the mail voices so let's say if i go with ethan hi this is ethan this this sound is good let's select this one and now for this block ethan has been selected if you want to change the pitch you can do that as well if you want to change the speed you can do that as well but in ethan we don't have the pitching i mean uh, we don't have the tone option right so you need to keep in mind that all of these characters doesn't have the tone option so if you select male again if you hide the pro voices and if you select miles again miles have this tone option and inspirational would be the best option over here right in a same way now what you can do is for example if i change the character uh, if i hide the pro ones and let's select the ethan again Hi, this is ethan i selected ethan now what i can do is i can apply the setting to all the these blocks uh, the setting basically if i want if for example if i made changes in the pitching if i made changes in the uh, speed you can apply all these settings in, with just one click to all your blocks and how you can do that you need to click on this three dot icon and here you will be able to see apply settings to the project and if you click here this setting this same pitching option speed option will be applied to the all blocks obviously it is going to ask you again so if i click here as you can see what settings you want to apply to the whole project you want to apply the voice you want to apply the voice style which is general right and then you want to apply the speed for example i don't want to apply the speed i just want to apply voice voice style and pitching so and if i hit the apply button as you can see ethan has been applied to all the blocks and all the pitching option i mean uh, pitch is also been applied but obviously i didn't selected the speed that's why this block has the minus 3% speed but uh, others doesn't have right so let me go back and select the miles again and the tone will be inspirational and i'm going to apply this to complete project so apply setting to complete project apply all the settings uh let's do okay let's apply all the settings to all the project after this we do have multiple other options as well if you click on this three dot icon right so for uh, for example if you click here you will see this three dot icon so you do have multiple options but here you do have three dot icon as well but you don't get uh, many options over here like move up and down is also uh, turned off download is turned off just pronunciation and manage pronunciation option is here so pronunciation is basically here you can see the pronunciation option for example uh, some there are uh, some words that ai can't read read properly so in that case you can use pronunciation option and this is how you can use the pronunciation option for example if i select a reaching word and if, by just after selecting pronunciation option will automatically appear if you click here this option will appear so what you can do is you can create your custom pronunciation here and 
for example if i click, click on custom pronunciation and here i can write the alternative spelling of the pronunciation for example if you want to type digital right and ai is not able to uh, speak or ai is not able to uh, read digital properly so in that case you can type digital word in this type as well d d i then space g i then space then t a l so in this case ai will read it digital so this is how you can create your uh, custom pronunciations right after this we were talking about this th this three dot icon so in that case we do have up and down so uh, up and down is basically to move your blocks for example if i click move down this block will move down to the second option second block in the same way you can move move it go back right and after this we do have download audio for example you just want to download this audio only this blocks audio only you can download you can download the script after this the pronunciation and manage pronunciations basically the options i've talked about is here if you click here the same pronunciation option will appear and the manage pronunciation is basically you can manage all the pronunciations in your library right and after this we do have copy block settings so basically you can copy the uh, block settings of this block and you can apply to other blocks as well for example you want to apply all this all the settings to this block you can go here this three dot icon and not here you can go here and you can paste the block settings here right so this is how it's done after this we do have the duplicate block if you want to duplicate the block as you can see if i click the duplicate it has duplicate the same block here again right so let me delete this and after this we do have this delete button right now the third block as i told you third block is uh, a female voice right so we need to replace this miles vo miles voice with a female voice let's introducing say. perfect meal okay so let's select natalie or let's check whether natalie is free no natalie is not comes under the free version so let's select naomi change okay it's naomi is a little bit puppy active is a puppy sized step up your charlotte. grilling game with open barbecue charlotte is fine. and get so let's ready select charlotte we have selected charlotte here right now what we can do is we can hit this play button here to check whether the script is properly uh, working or the whether the script is properly done or not right and you have the option charlotte's option is narration only so if i click play this will uh, generate the audio of complete project and you can listen the audio as you can see this is this is generating right now yeah it has been generated in today's fast paced world reaching your target audience has never been more crucial right so this is how it's done after this you can go to add media option in media option you can uh, add stock music as well basically you can add the background audio here as well so to add media obviously you need to click here you can see different different kinds of media over here for example if you play here so these are the different background audio options and the best part of uh, using stock music from here you can see different kind of characteristics option you can see different kind of genre option instrument option mood option so there's a vast library of different audios which you can use from here so that you don't have to apply audio while doing the post production because the main the biggest hassle is to find the audio perfect audio but here uh, all the audios has been segregated in a different i mean in a very professional manner right so you can find the perfect voice for your perfect script for example i'm going to use a fun mood audio so these are the fun mood audio i'm i can play it and if i like it i can apply this audio by just clicking here hit the next button and i can select from where i want to apply the audio like from halfway or maybe from starting and i can just click on add to timeline and this audio will be added to my timeline as you can see now with the script i do have the audio as well background audio if i play here click on play here this will again create the audio with the i mean this will synchronize the background audio with my script and after this i can click on the play button in order to in today's fast paced world 
reaching your target audience has never been more crucial. Meet Sarah, a digital marketing specialist who knows the ins and outs of online promotion. Digital marketing isn't just about post. Right. If you want, you can do the changes in your background audio as well. So basically right now I do have these options and I, I haven't added any video here. If you want, you can add the video and stock images as well. There are options for that too. Right. So basically you can create a simple if you want to create a video proper video with the audio and uh, stock images and stock videos you can create the video in murph.ai as well right but let's talk about the uh, script and the background audio right now right so if you want to do any kind of changes for example you want to increase the background audio you can do this and now there's a change in background audio right so every time if you do any changes in the audios and the scripts this will create again this will uh, synchronize all the things paced world reaching your target audience has never been more right so this time you will be able to listen uh, background audio more clearly if you want you can increase the audio if you want you can increase the script audio it is totally up to you right after this, I've already told you the stock image option and video option. If you want, you can add these stock image and videos as well. For example, if you want to add the stock, uh, this one, or maybe there's any digital marketing related video. And this this library is powered by Pexels. So all the all these videos are coming from Pexels, right? So for example, I like this one. I just need to click here. I need to click on timeline and I can add the video into the timeline right and if i hit the play button obviously it is going to synchronize all the thing properly and then we'll be able to listen it and this video also has some kind of audio if you want to listen you can unmute it otherwise you can uh, keep it it keep it mute right now this time if you want to listen to the world. video i mean if you want to see the video you can see the preview over here if you want, you can increase this by clicking here, something like this. Reaching your target audience has never been more crucial. Meet Sarah, a digital marketing specialist. Right, but uh, I think this uh, moff.io is mainly for the audio or more than that, you can add a background noise. I mean, background uh, music. But I don't think you should add any kind of video or anything from here. You can do that in your post production, in your different uh, video editing software. But it is up to you. If you want to create a video with stock images and videos, then it is up to you. Then you can use Muff.io. Then we do have voice changer option as well. You can upload any audio or any video which you want to change the voice. That option is also here. But for example, your script is ready. Right, because there is a catch over here. After your script is ready, you can basically you can check out or you can take a preview again. Last time, In today's fast paced world, reaching your target audience has never been more crucial. Meet Sarah, a digital marketing specialist who knows the ins and outs. If everything is done right now, you can't just click on export and you can download the audio because the downloading audio option is not available here as you can see right so there's no any download option in the free version right so you can't go with the low quality or wave format obviously there are options if you go for the paid version you can download the file into wave format basically you have multiple options like video for example if you have created video you can download the video into mp4 M mov then if you want to download voice only, if you want to download voice and music, tons of options are there, but you can't download if unless you are not uh, upgrading your plan. But there's again one catch which you can use in order to uh, download this complete audio. And what is that? You can screen record or you can record the internal audio of your computer by just uh, using any screen recorder software like i am using obs studio right because mov.io is very fabulous software when in terms of audio creation that's why people 
love to use morph.io but this limitation is very problematic so in that case obviously you need to uh, use any kind of screen recording software as i am recording and as you are able to listen my recorded audio as well in today's fast paced world reaching your target audience has never been more crucial meet sarah a digital marketing specialist who knows the ins in the same way you can also download the audio right and if you don't want to install any obs software something like this or any kind of third party screen recording software there's a hidden option in your windows computers like windows 11 and windows 10 you can just press ctrl g in your computer and this kind of gaming mode will appear in your computer if you have windows 10 or 11 right and here you can see the screen recording software over here so using this capture option or using this screen recording option you can record the audio of uh, morph.io as well and you can edit this into the post production right so this is also an good option. This is also a good option to use uh, or to get the Moff.io's audio without even installing any third party software, right? I hope you like the tutorial. I hope you like this uh, trick basically. And if you still have any question, query, any kind of confusion, you can comment down below. I'll answer those questions in the comment section itself.